I'm going to begin uh, just by I mean, this film kind of thrives in, in the notion of us kind of reconnecting to our core values and, and remembering the sort of more important things in life, I suppose. Uh, do you ever find yourselves thinking that? Do you ever sort of find yourself sort of sitting there and thinking about, I don't know, what, some of the more simple things that we sort of sometimes lose sight of? Well, it's interesting that we both said that we love to go for a walk by ourselves, mm. presumably. Yes. Uh, uh, and w both without conferring with each other. That's one of our, the great things we love to do. That's simple. And uh, for me, anyway, um, not to be dramatic, but I know that I'm slightly running out of time. And I just want to make the most of every day, whatever, however I can do that. Oh, uh, yeah, I think it's very, it's absolutely vital to plug back in to your life because you know we live in a make-believe if you mm. like yeah. our job is pretending and dressing up and being other people and delving into uh, other people's pain or whatever and to be able to just be y yourself and I quite like being on my own and being quiet uh, that sort of revives me and restores me and going for a walk and things like that. So I think, and going back to what really makes you happy um, or content or bored, being bored is quite good. Because mm. mm. uh, only by doing nothing can stuff mm. maybe emerge. If you're always, always get filling it and filling it with other things, I think, just, just stop for a minute. Mm. And then that really, I think, is... You're absolutely is quite, right, and yeah. it does give children, for instance, a, a cr creative um, urge that they might not have had time for before. It's yeah. absolutely dead yeah. right. I mean, often when you have films that have sort of protagonists over the age of 40, 50, I mean, they can fall into the same trapping. Sometimes there'll be sort of jokes about sort of struggling with technology and things like that. But, yeah. but this felt like every character was much, very human. This film was very, it gave every character sort of life. I mean, did that just come off the page when you got the screenplay? Yes, I think the, 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 the script, it, it's not about how old we are. No. It's nothing to it do really with that. It isn't, actually. And, and I think that's what, and you're quite right, that's really refreshing. It's just about what's happening in our lives at this time and not to be made fun of. Mm. And as you said, it's no one, no one saying, well, I, you know, well, a little bit, you know, where's my phone or whatever. Mm. But it's not about the struggle. Mm. It's about how you're dealing with stuff and the, all these characters deal with things and they don't shy away from them. And I mean, obviously, one of the, the, the key themes in this as well is dancing. Do you guys like to boogie? Have you ever, are you, did you ever do dancing classes or have you done dancing classes in the past? Uh, I have. Mm. I mean, I, I'm not... Uh, I like quite dancing by myself. <laughs> <laughs> if, a, if a Danube comes on or, or Capelia, the ballet music and things, on, on the radio, I do dance around the kitchen. Please don't look in the window because I probably <laughs> will fall over or at least over balance because I haven't got the balance that I used to have. Mm -hmm. But I, I love to do it, yes. I think it's a great, great um, joy. And I was wondering too, I mean, uh, no, no, I was wondering, cause, am I right in thinking because you and Timothy went to acting school yeah. together? That must have been great to have, because I, I can't actually recall, I mean, obviously both involved in Harry Potter franchise, but I can't recall you two being on screen. Uh, I did an episode actually. He did mm. a wonderful series called Frank Stubbs, and I did yes. an episode of that with him. Mm. Uh, of course, I'm a, I'm a huge admirer. I mean, Alfie de Sain, you know. And, mm. But at drama school, we, we weren't. We were in the. We were there at the same time, so we never acted with him at drama school. But he was always, you know, Tim was just top dollar. Mm. So uh, I, I've always been a huge fan of him, and as a person, he's the funniest man alive. So and the uh, kindest, actually. So, mm. yeah. I've been married to him. Oh. Do you not mean that in a... Not in real life. <laughs> no. No. Well, a big exclusive there. <laughs> yeah, but, but yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, well, we, we adore him. And, yeah. and, and as sisters, we adore him in the film, so we couldn't have yeah. chosen better. Yeah. And I mean, you've both, I mean, because obviously, uh, Mada, you did Paddington too, you've got a, a, a sort of very integral role in that. And then uh, Monster Family is coming out. It must be quite nice to make movies that, you know, do you get sort of the enjoyment that derives from making movies that can be appreciated by people of any age? That must be, and also particularly with Paddington too. I mean, that was just a phenomenon. I mean, and so good. <laughs> how could that be better than the first one? I don't know how they did it. Oh, I went into it. So rare. It, it, you, uh, so, yeah. So, so to be part of something that uh, you think is, gosh, this is ticking every single box with great you know, great artistry and integrity and wit and, um, and honour, actually. I think it's a film that people are honourable in that film. Mm. Paddington is very honourable, but he ain't dull. No.
Mm -hmm. I remember when I, I read some of the reviews and it said, oh, Paddington 2 is even better than the first. I thought, well, that obviously can't be possible no. because the first was amazing. I, and it was. Uh, absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> I don't know how they did it. I really enjoyed the film as well. And I was just wondering about, in regards to, because I mean, I'm 29 years old and I got something out of it. I mean, I just, what do you think it is about this film that has this accessibility that can appeal to anybody of any age? I'm, I'm sort of the joy that is in it, I think. I, I mean, I'm, I'm absolutely thrilled that, that we're now talking to much younger people and they're loving it. Um, it it's simple, it's unpredictable. It's, I'm thrilled also that people don't think that it's um, cosy. Yeah. Well, I think you know, you've, got, you've just got people dealing with their problems in a very humorous way. Mm. Then they get to go dancing, then they jump in a pond. Uh, th that actually, it's not, um, as you said, it's not just people, it's not boring. Mm. And they're people who don't have boring lives, and it's rather, and it's, I think it's hugely entertaining. I mean, look, you know, of course we're going to think it's good, you know, <laughs> we're in it, but I can sit back and, and I'm, I'm quite, I can be objective, and I, you know, I've done a lot of films that are no good. I still have to talk about them, but I think this is genuinely really entertaining mm. for whatever age. Mm. So it's not you're not locked into. You know. And it's mm. completely by the by that we're the age we are. That's I'm yeah. thrilled that, that we've only just I've only just realised that we yeah. don't refer to our ages at all. No, Brilliant. well, thanks so much for your time today. It's been a real Good. pleasure. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Lovely Cheers. to meet you. you. Thank you. Bye -bye. Thank thanks. You. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching. Hey, you guys. Hey, you guys, huh? Hey, you guys. Is yeah. that from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey, you guys!